What's going on everybody? It's just another day in the kitchen, back with another episode, and in today's video we're going to be reviewing Travis Scott's most expensive collab yet, the Audemar Piguet Cactus Jack Collection. Now earlier this morning he posted on his Instagram story that the collection was now live, so you know for your boy it was like me seeing the Batman symbol and I had to cook up this review. Of course, earlier this week, Travis Scott was in New York to preview the collection with Audemars Piguet, and in this video, we're going to be reviewing the merch that he's actually wearing on his body, along with the rest of the pieces that are available online. Now, while you're here, you might as well go ahead and drop a like and subscribe. Now, right off the bat, I want to say that I do have high hopes for this collaboration, given that this is a follow-up on Travis Scott's most recent Utopia merch collab, and if you followed my videos, you know that the shipping situation was a pretty big disaster, so I have a little bit of higher hopes. Now, when it comes to the actual watch itself, they mentioned that there's only 200 pieces made and it's allegedly immediately sold out. However, I'm not so sure about that given that the retail is allegedly $200,000. Now, when it comes to this Audemars Piguet collaboration and collection, I don't expect any of the merch to actually be cheap, given that it is a luxury watch brand. And to start off, I did want to show off this piece right here with a retail price of $85 for the tee and an alleged or suggested shipping time of six to eight weeks. And I say that because if you've been following my Utopia merch videos, we all know that we were misled and it is what it is with the shipping times. Now for this overall collection, my overall thoughts just looking at it in general is that I think this is going to be a little bit out of my price range in general. The AP lifestyle that the rappers talk about and that they rap about in their lyrics is definitely out of my price range, and that's just me being honest. However, in this video, I do want to cover some pieces that I think are a little cooler or a little bit more worth it such as this piece right here, which is basically two different hoodies or jackets stitched together for a cool price of $305. Now, like I mentioned earlier in the week, Laflame was spotted in New York taking a break from his Utopia tour, and he was actually spotted wearing this collaborative merch piece right here, which I do think is pretty hard. However, for $305, it's a little bit steep for your boy right now. Now, another unique feature of this hoodie that I wanted to point out is that it also has this pre-cut hole where I guess you're supposed to advertise your AP or watch, which may or may not be the smartest thing to wear depending on where you're living. Overall, I think it's a cool design and I think it's cool that they took these two different zip-ups and put them together. However, for a retail price of $305, it might be a little bit out of my price range like I mentioned. However, I can appreciate the effort that went into creating this overall collection and I know it's been something that Travis has been working on for quite some time. Now next up, we've got a classic returning to the Travis Scott merch lineup, which is of course an ashtray. However, for $250, I think you can find something a little bit cheaper to ash into. Now to follow up the $250 ashtray, we've got perhaps the cheapest item in this collection so far, which is the hat for $60, and then these random leather gloves for $150, which I'm not sure what you would use them for, but perhaps this is maybe a little bit too bougie of a lifestyle item for myself. If you have an idea what you would use the gloves for, let me know in the comments. Now, like I mentioned, this one is a very pricey collection, and you'll see throughout the rest of this video that there are some outrageous pieces. Now, something that you'll notice with the actual merch style of the items that have been uploaded is that they've taken a little bit of a different direction when it comes to uploading the pieces themselves. Most of the times it's just a mock-up, but as you can see from some of these images, we're actually getting a little preview of what it would look like. And this piece right here I actually really dig and may pick up for myself. I just wanted to show you guys that there are different options for everybody in here. However, given that this is the collaboration with Audemars Piguet, which is of course a luxury lifestyle watch brand, the retail is not going to be friendly for consumers. Now, before this collection was officially announced, I did find these pieces online. So just to give you an idea of the quality or what it may look like in hand, I just wanted to include this one, especially given that we were just looking at this uh, crew neck right here. And I do want to point out that for $235, that is a little bit steep. And so far, I don't know if I've seen anything that has really, really jumped out to me. Although I do want to point out that the last crew neck for 105 is definitely giving me that utopia vibe and style, and it definitely reminds me of something that could have been artistically from the last collection. Now, Travis, being the king of merch, decided to throw something a little bit different at us this time with the AP collection by featuring a $125 Cactus Jack umbrella followed up with this random ass keychain that you can cop for $100. And following that up, we've got a very random and generic AP Cactus Jack card holder for $200 with not a whole lot going on. 
I kind of wish these descriptions would give us a little bit more information about the actual quality and what to expect. However, again, on the surface level right now with these mock-up photos, I don't know that these are really speaking to me. If you do have the extra money and you're, of course, an AP connoisseur or a fan of Travis, there are some great pickups. Now, returning to some tees here, you can see that we're back in that $85 price range, which is about a $30 jump from the generic $55 tees from the last Utopia drop, and unfortunately appears to be the norm when it comes to the rest of this overall AP collection, which again, I'm not surprised at. Now, like I mentioned at the beginning of this video, this is definitely the most expensive Travis Scott merch collab I've seen so far. And to follow that up, we've got this Cactus Jack AP jacket for a cool $1,850, which I think is probably the most expensive piece of merch he's dropped so far. And surprisingly, there's not a whole lot in the description to really justify it for myself. Now, we do have some cool sweaters here, which are, again, pretty pricey. However, I can see myself wearing. Another thing that I wanted to point out throughout this actual collection is that there's a lot of use of symbolism when it comes to the brand itself, with the belt most recently featuring something that looks like the watch face, and even, even the $250 ashtray we saw earlier resembling the AP watch face as well. Now you're going to see some of the merch that Travis was wearing as well in the photo earlier, however the overall direction that I would say of this is just that it's expensive and bougie. From the comments I saw online, a lot of people that are actually into these kind of luxury watches, they felt that this collaboration was kind of unnecessary and cheapening the brand. I kind of get the vibe that a lot of these snobs and elitists think that this is below them and that a brand like AP doesn't need to collaborate with someone like Travis Scott, and perhaps that is true. However, I do think that it is cool that an artist does have the ability to have such a grand collaboration. And in continuing with the whole bougie and cozy vibe of this AP collection, we've of course got that robe for 300 which is not the first time Travis has dropped a merch robe collection, as well as those dope socks. And personally, this hat right here might be one of my favorite pieces that I actually pick up from this collection. In my opinion, it's simple, you can wear it with anything, and it's got a little bit of the Cactus Jack as well as the AP symbolism. And now to wrap up the Cactus Jack AP collection, we've got these dope shorts that I would actually wear, as well as this 300 hundred dollar blanket which i think is a cool memento however i don't think it's necessarily for me now and following in the tradition of the utopia drop this drop also features the option to purchase every single item from this collection at the bottom of the website so i decided to see what the heck it would cost for the hell of it now i am a size large and as you can see if i had an extra six thousand nine hundred dollars i could be the owner of every piece from this collection with that being said, I'm not surprised at some of the high retail prices given that this is a luxury watch brand, and I am excited for Travis being that I am a fan and this is something that's been in the works for four years. Now speaking of the watch, I wanted to give you guys an idea of what it looks like, and like I mentioned earlier in this video, there are only 200 in existence. Now with that being said, I'd love to know what you guys think of the AP Cactus Jack collection and if you ended up picking up any pieces yourselves. I'm not sure that the price ranges are super friendly to most Travis Scott fans, and I think that this collaboration is a little bit too bougie for most of us. However, I am excited for La Flame, and I am, of course, here to support. As always, guys, let me know what you guys think about this video and what you would like to see me cover next. Please stay safe out here, and as always, thank you so much for cooking with the kitchen. And just remember, it's lit, straight up, and peace.